How to stop your dog from aggressive. 10 dogs know for aggression. Are you are looking to get a new puppy to keep as a family pet if your answer is yes, would like to know which breeds may not be the safest for children. In doing this video research, I found that different organizations and experts have differing opinions as to which dog breeds are the ways to stop your dog from aggressive, so I've listed the 10 that most sources seem to agree on below. So first of all, what is dog aggression? Is defined. Dog aggression is typically defined as dangerous behavior directed at another individual, like a human or another dog. Aggressive behaviors include barking, biting, lunging, snarling, etc. The causes of these behaviors can range from territorial defensiveness and protectiveness to fear and social anxiety. How I determine which dog breeds are the most dangerous. The 10 breeds listed below had some of the lowest overall passing rates in the temperament test conducted by the American Temperament Test Society and are sorted in order from lowest to the highest percentage of individual dogs that passed. Breeds with the lowest passing percentages frequently showed signs of aggression, panic, or extreme shyness during the test. While there are breeds with even lower passing percentages than those mentioned in this video, I've decided to limit this list to the 10 breeds that are most frequently ranked as highly aggressive, that is, these are breeds that are most commonly considered aggressive or dangerous and or are included in breed-specific legislation. Each breed on the list is discussed in greater detail in the sections below, and overall passing rates are included for each. The 10 Most Dog Breeds Chihuahua Dachshund, Chow Chow, Doberman Pinscher, Dalmatian, Rottweiler, Jack Russell Terrier, German Shepherd, American Staffordshire Pit Bull Terrier, Siberian Husky. You need to understand that, Chihuahuas are loyal and devoted but may bark and snap at people they don't know well. 1. Chihuahua. The Chihuahua is the smallest breed of dog registered with the American Kennel Club AKC, and is thought to be the smallest in the world. They are included in the toy group of dogs and usually range from around 4 to 6 pounds. They can have short or long hair of just about any color, and their coloring can be solid, marked, or splashed. Having originated in the Mexican state of Chihuahua, hence the name, the breed is considered to be one of the oldest in America. It was first introduced to Europe by famous colonizer Christopher Columbus. Chihuahuas are typically very loyal and devoted to their owners, but they are generally one or two person dogs. They can be devoted to the point of jealousy and may bite or snip at individuals who come too close to their owner. They are very temperamental and are not known to be particularly child friendly. Because they do not usually like strangers, they bark often and can serve effectively as alert style watch dogs. 2. Dachshund, Standard Smooth. The Dachshund is categorized as a member of the Hound group by the AKC. Ranging in size from around 8 to 32 pounds, they can have long or short hair of just about any natural color. They originated in Germany in the 17th century and were used primarily to hunt badgers. By the end of World War I, they were on the verge of extinction, but populations have since recovered, and they are now one of the most popular dogs in America. The Dachshund is susceptible to small dog syndrome, which basically means that it often tries to make up for its small size with a large attitude. This can lead to a variety of behavioral issues. If socialized at an early age, they can do well with children, but they do not enjoy rough play. Take caution with small pets, such as mice, rats, and hamsters, as dachshunds have a strong hunting instinct toward this type of animal. Chow owls tend to be dominant and assertive, so first-time owners may encounter training difficulties. 3. Chow Chow the Chow Chow is listed as a medium-sized dog in the non-sporting group by the AKC. They typically weigh between 45 and 70 pounds and have long, thick coats that can come in red, black, blue, cream, or cinnamon colors. The exact origin of the Chow Chow is unknown, but it is believed that they originated thousands of years ago in either China or Mongolia where they were most often used as hunting and herding dogs. 
They became popular in the US during the 20th century when President Calvin Coolidge kept one as a pet. Chow Chows tend to have dominant personalities and can become assertive at times. Because of their assertiveness, they are not recommended for first-time dog owners. Strong guidance and firm training are required in order to raise a well-mannered Chow Chow. It has also been noted that they do not have good peripheral vision, so they can be startled easily. Doberman pincers are highly intelligent and very protective of their owners. 4. Doberman Pinscher The Doberman Pinscher is listed by the AKC as a medium-sized dog in the working group. They range in size from around 70 to 90 pounds and have thick, glossy, short-haired coats that come in red, black, blue, or fawn colors. A man by the name of Carl Louis Doberman is credited with developing this German breed. He worked as a tax collector and wanted a dog that he could take with him for protection on his visits to the more dangerous areas to which he traveled. Dobermans are very intelligent and have been widely used as guard dogs and for police work. They have a very strong, protective instinct towards their masters, but if faced with strong leadership and good honors, they can get along with children as well as other dogs. Dalmatians have a lot of energy, so they require a lot of exercise and play. 5. Dalmatian The Dalmatian is listed by the AKC as a medium-sized dog in the working group. They range in size from around 45 to 60 pounds and have short, dense, glossy coats that are white with either black or brown spots. The exact origin of the Dalmatian has not been confirmed. Similar dogs are depicted running behind chariots and paintings found on the walls of some Egyptian tombs. Since the late 18th century, they have been used as carriage dogs to guard passengers and cargo. Dalmatians need to be socialized at an early age. They are good with children, but if not given enough attention by their owner, they can develop behavioral issues. They are very energetic dogs and require frequent opportunities to release some of this energy through exercise and play. Rottweilers tend to be somewhat aloof and may not get along well with strangers. 6. Rottweiler The Rottweiler is listed as a large-sized dog in the working group. They can range in size from around 85 to 130 pounds and are short-haired with straight, dense coats that are usually black with rust or mahogany markings. The Rottweiler gets its name from the small town of Rotlin, Germany. It was first known as the Rottweil Butcher's Dog, but the name was later shortened to Rottweiler. In the earlier days, they were used for cattle herding and bear hunting, among other things. Later on, they became popular in the US as guard dogs, and many worked with the army and police forces. Rottweilers can be rather aloof and do not usually get along with strangers easily. They are very loyal and protective of their owners, and they tend to defend their home areas. They are normally good-natured with children, but because of their size and energy level, they are not recommended for families with infants or toddlers. Jack Russell Terriers are stubborn and energetic, so they may not be the best choice for families with small children. 7. Jack Russell Terrier the Jack Russell Terrier breed is not recognized by the AKC due to opposition from the breed's parent society, the Jack Russell Terrier Club of America Jirka. This has resulted in the recognition of the Parson Russell Terrier instead. The Jack Russell Terrier and Parson Terrier are basically the same breed, but there are some minor differences. Jack Russells are small-sized dogs that range in size from around 14 to 18 pounds and are predominantly white in color with black or tan markings. The coats can be short-haired, long-haired, or broken. The term broken refers to coats that feature both long and short hair. Jack Russells originated in England where they were primarily used for fox hunting, but they have also been used in groundhog and badger hunting. Russell Terriers tend to be very energetic and stubborn dogs. They have little patience and are not known to be very tolerant of children. Most experts recommend that families with young children choose another breed, especially if they are first-time dog owners. German Shepherds are very popular in the US and frequently work as police or rescue animals. 8. German Shepherd the German Shepherd is a medium-sized breed included in the herding group by the AKC. 
They range in size from around 70 to 85 pounds and typically have a mix of brown, grey, black, and tan fur. The breed originated in Karlsruhe, Germany, in the 1800s. During World War I, they were used as military dogs by both the German and French armed forces. They are a very intelligent breed and were the first to be used as guide dogs for the blind. They are also used in search and rescue teams and frequently serve as police and narcotic dogs. The German Shepherd has become one of the most popular dogs in America. They tend not to like strangers, so they make good guard dogs. Despite appearing on many aggressive dogs lists, everything I have read and experienced tells me that they are good with children. As long as they are not trained as guard dogs, I personally do not view German Shepherds as an aggressive breed. American Pit Bull Terriers tend to get a bad reputation, but if properly socialized and trained, they can make great pets. The American Staffordshire Terrier, also known as the American Pit Bull Terrier, is a medium-sized dog included in the Terrier group that usually weighs from around 55 to 65 pounds. They originated in the Staffordshire region of England, hence the name. The first strain of this breed was designed for use as guard dogs and for dog fighting, so they were bred to have stronger, stockier frames. When the breed was brought to America and dog fighting was banned, a second strain of this breed developed. This new variation was more mild-mannered and smaller framed. Known as the American Pit Bull, this newer strain of Pit Bull is very loyal and protective of its owner and family. They are also known for being very good and patient with children, but if you are uncertain about a Pit Bull's pedigree, do a background check before you choose it as a family pet. Siberian Huskies may be territorial and don't always get along with other pets. 10. Siberian Husky the Siberian Husky is a medium-sized dog listed in the working group by the AKC. They range in size from around 35 to 70 pounds and have medium-length hair and a double coat. Their colors are red and white, black and white, gray and white, or silver. They originated in Siberia, where they were used to pull sleds over long distances in cold climates. They have also been used as rescue dogs. Through my research, and my experience owning four Siberian Huskies, I cannot find definitive studies that prove Huskies have aggressive personalities, but they have appeared on many lists of aggressive dogs, which is why they are on this one. From my experience, Huskies do tend to be territorial and do not always get along well with other dogs, but they are usually good with children. I recommend this interesting and informative book in the descriptions below.